Hello, dear colleagues. I'm Olena Holovnya from Zhitomir Polytechnic State University. Today, I'd like to present interim results of the research which is aimed to design and implement a virtual online laboratory with Linux online environments to support the operating systems course. This stage of the research has been conducted in collaboration with Vasil Petrovich Oleksyuk from Ternopil Volodymyr Natyuk National Pedagogical University and the uh, Institute of Information Technologies and Learning Tools of the NAES of Ukraine. This part of the study is about selecting cloud computing software for a virtual online laboratory supporting the operating systems course. Virtualization technologies are widely used for operating systems course and also virtual online laboratories became popular for teaching various courses, including courses in operating systems. However, operating systems uh, course belongs to the courses with needs that are considerably harder to meet than the needs of most of the courses. Uh, most of the courses uh, usually could be taught using cloud services of a software as a service, SAAS model. And um, uh, while SAAS is not enough for OS courses in most cases. So the purpose of the study was to make a survey on uh, cloud platforms uh, applicable for a virtual online laboratory containing Linux online environments in the OS course to compare these platforms and to select the most suitable platforms. Our recent practical experience includes, includes uh, on, the on, on one hand, uh, my experience on teaching an OS course uh, to students of computer engineering, cyber security, computer science, and other specializations uh, using virtualization tools, uh, which include Oracle VirtualBox hypervisor, Amazon EC2 instances, uh, virtual machine from NDG Linux Essentials, course uh, in Cisco Networking Academy and also biometal installation without virtualization. And on the other hand, uh, our experience also includes the experience of Vasil Petrovich, uh, who is one of the authors of the research about design and implementation of uh, cloud laboratory based on Apache cloud stock and uh, is, uh, this laboratory is intended for teaching the CCNA Cyber Operations course at Cisco Networking Academy. Uh, previously, the Maya features of the Linux Online Virtual Environment for this course uh, have been formulated, and this includes the support of most commons, including administrative, administrative privileges for students in guest environments, the networking support, at least basic networking support, the support of uploading and downloading files and saving them between reboots, uh, the ability to update guest operating systems, the support of bash scripting. An overview of the ready-made solutions showed that most of these solutions could be used for OS course at least partially. But at the same time, these solutions have potential problems like functional limitations, non-free usage, and also the terms of use could change, which may be frustrating. So individually designed virtual Linux uh, environments for the operating systems course should provide students with opportunities close to those given by providers of uh, infrastructure as a service model, which is the third category, but the solution must be more provider independent. Also, we still appreciate compatibility between analyzed cloud computing and providers cloud service platforms. We outlined the main uh, directions for virtualization platforms with selections, and these platforms uh, should be cloud-based um, because of the scalability of these implementations, and um, they also should belong to uh, IAS model because uh, of the need of control on the infrastructure. Uh, uh, 
this platform should support private cloud model uh, because uh, of using exclusively by university. Uh, um, these platforms should not be a ready-made environments and uh, it also would be useful um, at least at early stages of implementation to have more than one platform uh, to have an alternative tools. Basic requirements for cloud computing software for this laboratory uh, include um, private cloud deployment model support, Linux guest support, distribution under free and open source software licenses, virtual networking support, web interfaces for students, detailed documentation, and integration with authentication protocols, uh, namely LDP. Um, and there are also some additional requirements, uh, namely it would be good if even during early stages of implementing these tools will serve as a platform for students' extracurricular and scientific work. So it should have some basic installation variant for beginners and it also would be great also to have a Windows guest support. We analyzed four popular cloud computing software, uh, which is available under free and open source licenses, Eucalyptus, OpenStack, CloudStack, and Open Nebula. All analyzed platforms conform to the requirements. Also, every platform has interesting and promising features, like Eucalyptus's compatibility with Amazon, uh, AWS and also Open Nebulous integration with uh, AWS and Azure OpenStax uh, support of open standards and CloudStax uh, integration with the AWS uh, API also. Uh, next, I give the floor to my colleague Vasily Leksuk, who has more close practical experience on using Apache CloudStack. Apache CloudStack is another free platform for virtual online labs. It is designed using model digital tools and is available for installation on Red Hat and Debian compatible Linux distribution. The platform enables the corporation to deploy a full-featured private or hybrid cloud according to the infrastructure as a service model. Among the main technical capabilities of the platform are operational system management via a browser, support for different hypervisors in one cloud infrastructure, such as Xen, KVM, Minvare, Hyper-V, connect to VM uh, into virtual networks and access them via standard protocols, creating new virtual machines based on templates, saving the states of virtual machines, authentication using uh, protocol DAP and SSO, uh, extension of functionality of uh, platform by API function. In the educational process, our deployment Apache Power Stack provides aggregation of resources for multiple physical hosts. This allows us to use uh, different hardware, migration of virtual machines uh, of students between different hosts and storages, access to uh, virtual machines via uh, web interface and standard network protocols. In particular, the uh, VPN protocols provides for students secure internet access to cloud infrastructure. Launch virtual machines uh, inside another virtual machines Distribution of students by domain corresponding to academ academic group and learning process. The online lab for studying uh, the Linux operation system is one of the last, last uh, to be deployed by us. It is based on the NDG Linux course from Cisco Networking Academy. The sandbox is used in the original course to perform laboratory work. We have ex expanded the content of the course by task 
that students perform in the Apache cloud stack. They relate to learning graphical interfaces, multitasking, multi-user mode, and scripting. Let's move to conclusions. As far as all the analyzed platforms conform to the requirements, we currently selected the OpenStack Cloud Platform as a platform of the first choice uh, because of its high flexibility conformance with open standards and its training lab scripts for beginners. But at the same time, the other three platforms, CloudStack, Eucalyptus, and Open Nebula, uh, also look promising and meet most of the requirements. So these platforms have been selected as platforms of the second choice. And the future studies should focus on pilot empirical research on selected cloud platforms and developing the model of a virtual online laboratory for supporting the OS course. Thank you for your attention. And if you have any questions, we'll be glad to answer them.